Hey there rescuers. So there you are in the field and you've got a really smooth kind of slick tree as your, uh, as your bomber anchor. And uh, you wrap a piece of webbing around there to make a quick safe anchor. Let's say you decide to do uh, a basket hitch. So you've got your basket hitch here, clip your master carabiner in there and you want to work from this position here and it just keeps on slipping down. You know, the basket hitch doesn't have that grip ability, but uh, boy, it's got some strength over 35 kilonewton strong, depending on your, uh, your webbing. So you go, okay, I really need some, some holding power here. I want it to constrict. So uh, let me use the, uh, the girth hitch or the lark's foot. So you change the configuration here, clip in and you go, oh yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Now it's constricting, it's gonna hold there. But then you start to think, huh, well I just changed the strength of my anchor significantly. So now I just have one strand of webbing clipped with the, with the girth hitch versus before I had two strands clipped. So quite a bit weaker. So you start thinking about through your scenario and your problem, you go, gosh, hmm, is there, is there another anchor configuration I could use? There is, there's another great one out there and I just want to make sure you guys are aware of it. It's called the Basket Plus or the Basket Hitch Plus. So I don't know, this is probably like a, a four and a half, five foot loop here. So you just need it a little bit longer for this configuration that I'm gonna show you guys here. So just got a piece of webbing here, a little bit longer. Got my, uh, my wire knot, my ring bend tied in here. So what we'll do now is instead of just on a, a turn and clipping like the basket hitch, I'm gonna do a full round turn. So I'm gonna go all the way around my anchor post like so, and then I'm gonna even out the ends of the slings like this, and this will be where I clip my carabiner into. So you can see here, um, essentially, I have a basket hitch configuration with an extra wrap going around the uh, the anchor. Once again, the basket hitch plus. So this gives me some constriction or holding power. You can see if I if I let go here and put some slack in these lines, it still holds and it's still really strong, quite a bit stronger than the girth hitch. So uh, research and testing by uh, Mortimer Angel and uh, Evans has shown that the basket hitch plus configuration has a very, very minimal uh, reduction in strength. So if you're using a new one inch tubular webbing uh, for this configuration, should be over 30 kilonewton strong, um, way stronger than the girth hitch. Uh, doesn't matter where you put the, uh, the knot, uh, it, you know, if you put the knot right here or somewhere on the, on the anchor post, uh, it, it should protect it a little bit and make it easier to untie, but we're not going to get any significant increase in strength by placing the knot in a strategic uh, location. Um, cool. Okay. Uh, let me know what you think about this, uh, this anchor. Uh, and uh, you guys stay safe out there. Stay strong. We'll see you in the next video.